First, I wanted to acknowledge the fact that we're here on Treaty 6 territory, and um, we're here in solidarity with our Indigenous brothers and sisters, and I hope that throughout the day and I mean, throughout the rest of your lives, you can sort of think about the ways in which you personally can facilitate um, reconciliation with our Indigenous brothers and sisters here on this land. Thank you so much. One question. Uh, what is your name? Now the court. That is Jeff. What does justice mean to you? <laughs> justice is... Whoa, whoa, can I... That's a really intense uh, question. I think it means the integrity of all human beings to be able to live a life authentically and be able to self-determine and make choices. And so anything that's standing in the way of people being able to make those choices uh, that's, that is constructed, uh, I think that is unjust. So justice means people can make choices freely and live authentically. Freedom. So freedom, I think, is goes hand in hand with justice because without freedom, we can't, uh, keep, even though people might be able to make these choices, if, if we're living in an overall situation where there, there is no freedom of choice at all, um, it, it underpins justice. So, so for in order for us to live in a just society, it's a it's an it's an ideal. We need freedom as a foundation. Thank you so much. My name is Leah Deschanu, and um, I'm here because I I'm here in solidarity along with um, along with being around people that do share the same experiences as I do. And I believe that the black experience is same everywhere, or we should understand it, or can identify with it everywhere. Um, justice to me is finding closure and closure in the right way, in the just way. Um, I think it's dealing with situations in the most unbiased, in the most contextual way possible. And I feel like what we see and how justice is not being served in the U.S. or even most parts of the world regarding black lives, it shows that they're not willing to contextualize our lives, but yet homogenize us and glaze over our who we are as people, not even as individuals. So. What is freedom to you? Freedom to me, freedom to me is something I wish I had to a certain degree as a kid because freedom is when we as people can just be who we are, when we can just be. We don't have to worry about how we're going to speak, how we come across, if we look too violent, if we look too stereotypical, if we're I, being angry black woman. Like, I just want to be angry. Like, that's freedom in the end of the day. I don't have to police myself. Thank you so much. Nasra Adam. Nice meeting you. What does justice mean to you? Uh, it's fulfilling our um, right as human beings and um, our job and purpose as human beings, which is basically just to uh, look after one another um, at the simplest form, I think. What does freedom mean to you? Oh, freedom is um, uh, when uh, I feel like spirit meets um, divine purpose. So when you're able to express uh, everything you're meant to express um, without uh, fear of, of being um, destroyed for it, you know? Um, I feel like that's all we're really trying to do as black folk out here, just to like like tap into our divine like power that we have um, and, and, and unleash it unapologetically. Um, but it's very, very difficult when you have forces around you that are trying to stifle that power. Um, 
So freedom for me is, is just release.